are here with Martin Davis, uh, overseas member of the Jamaica Under-17 team. You're in Valencia now. Tell us about the experience. Well, it's been a positive experience. I've been learning a lot. I've been with different teams under Valencia, and it's been a humbling experience. Learned about different aspects of football, mm -hmm. and yeah, I'm just hoping to bring it here. Help All right. Team as best as possible. You said you learned different aspects of football. What exactly, and how does it differ from football in Jamaica? Well, in my opinion, it's been they're more tactically inclined. Mm -hmm. Some people might think about tactics as only high press, low press, but them they go deeper into the aspects of tactical, defending, tactical, attacking, what we need to do to break defence, what we need to do to keep our defence compact, mm -hmm. etc. Alright, they converted you from a striker yeah. to a mid midfielder. Tell us about that. Well, I, anything that's best for the team. I was a striker before and they put me to play on the wing. Mm -hmm. um, was just, it because the team was loaded with strikers? or? I'm not sure on the exact decision. They just turned mm -hmm. to play right mid or left mid. and. I plan to help my team as best as possible. Mm -hmm. All right, do you impart what you have learned overseas to your, the rest of your team, especially the local based ones? Well, most definitely. I always try and everything that I learn, I try and bring it to my team to help them out. Mm -hmm. I try and response? teach them and just give them little tips. We learn from each other though, because they mm -hmm. teach me stuff and I teach them stuff. Mm -hmm. And okay. positive response, everybody's positive around here. You can talk to a person, a person can talk to you. It's just a learning process overall. Alright, how much has being in Spain helped your football? A whole lot. I've learned a new type of play. You know what everybody talks about, the tiki taka style, fast movement, fast thinking. And that has benefited me a lot because coming from Jamaica as more individual player, it's good to strike the balance between that, knowing when to pass and knowing when to dribble. So being abroad helped me to like own up my skills better to be a more complete player. Have you met any of the, the Spain international players? David Villa, I've Iniesta, I've met anybody? some of the players that have played for Valencia. I've met Mata before. Mm -hmm. I've met the goalkeeper. I've met a player, Banega, that played midfield. I've met a good amount of them. What was that like? Well, I didn't... Especially Mata. Like, undescribable feeling mm -hmm. when you see somebody that you see on TV every day. Mm -hmm. Told them hi and stuff like that. We talk mm -hmm. about it. All right, World Cup qualifiers just around the corner. What are you expecting well, from yourself and the team? I just want to give my best and help out my team as best as possible. As you know, it's a team sport and whatever the coach needs me to do, I'm going to give my 100% mm -hmm. to do that. You have a couple of years of experience in the number one football nation in the world yeah. now. You understand? Um, some will say Brazil, but Spain is actually number one right yeah. now. In terms of what you see in Jamaica, what do you think needs to be done in order to improve our football? Um, we Based on the experience you have, you, have, you have seen in Spain. I think for me, the best teams are always tactically well prepared. Real Madrid, Barcelona. I think Jamaicans need to be more tactically aware of what they're doing. And if we get that, the individualness of a player will transfer into the collectiveness of a team. Mm -hmm. And you see the more results happening. Because in Jamaica, I think that we're, with Brazil, we're one of the most talented. Um, we have one of the most talented players in the world. But sometimes we lack that teamwork aspect. Mm -hmm. In terms of living, though, how have you adapted? Because Spain is a totally different culture from yeah. Jamaica. New how food, have you handled it? New food, new climate, new everything. Mm -hmm. It's just they, my, one of my coach once told me that best players know how to adapt and mm -hmm. that's what I think I agree with that as well. So you have to know how to adapt because once you get that adaptiveness you can strive for whatever you want. All right, thank you very much Martin. Okay.